Hey guys, welcome to the Ticket Webcast. We're looking uh, to the week ahead in entertainment, arts, things to go out and do. And uh, next Tuesday through Saturday, we have not one but two five-day events taking over various venues uh, throughout Nashville. Um, one being the annual Tin Pan South uh, Songwriters Festival and also Nashville Fashion Week, which will also be taking place with multiple events Tuesday through Saturday. And here to tell us all about Nashville Fashion Week is Megan Rhodes. Megan, what can you tell me about Fashion Week? Well, you're going to be exhausted <laughs> after okay. I tell you about all it. All right. It's a parade of Nashville's beautiful people and the fashion talent. It begins next week, Tuesday, April 2nd, and it runs through Saturday, April 6th. Actually, I'm going to a kickoff uh, pop-up dinner tonight. Mm. It's going to be speakeasy themed. It's an early kickoff. Yeah. Well, <laughs> okay. well we just got to get our parties in. <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, there's going to be five nights of fashion. Um, there will be runway shows. There are going to be workshops. There are um, salon-style events, and some of the best parts are the post-show parties, mm -hmm. all of the after parties. Um, and what it does is it benefits the Nashville Fashion Ford Fund of the Community Foundation. <laughs> nice. It's a mouthful. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's designed to recognize um, the talented fashion professionals in the industry here. Mm -hmm. And it awards one person each year to kind of further their career. Gotcha. And uh, last year was Lauren Leonard of Leona. I'm actually wearing a Leona dress. I see. And, the, uh, the alliteration is all over the place here. I, I know. Fashion forward, <laughs> Leona. Okay. It's amazing. I'm not tongue tied. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, cool. um, so it'll be interesting to see who gets the award this year. First of all, Tuesday is the opening night. Um, it's going to be huge. They've got Red Doll, Cal Riemann, uh, two lines that are based in New York City, and they're featuring uh, Nunu, which is a beautifully tailored collection uh, by designer Misha Nunu, and um, and she, Gwyneth Paltrow wears her outfits, and Sarah Jessica Parker, and um, the the biggest name is Tracy Reese. Um, it's rich with art-inspired prints, and um, she's got a modern, contemporary, more sexy line called Plenty by Tracy Reese. And then uh, right after that, there is going to be an after party. Um, let's see, at Pub 5, brand new. They've been working on it the past couple of weeks on Fifth Avenue. Mm -hmm. So that'll be fun. Yeah. And then Wednesday, uh, they're going to have runway shows in the trolley barns that are downtown near the river. Gotcha. You've got a view of the city. It's going to be a really cool runway show. T Rains will be there, Cat Seaton, Tuft. Pink Elephant Designs, Black by Maria Silver. Um, the last three um, were featured as emerging designers last year for Nashville Fashion Week. And uh, so they will be showing all their new creations uh, for 2013. Um, earlier that day, there's going to be a panel of industry professionals, professionals doing um, workshops. There's three different ones. Uh, how to build a fashion brand, selling fashion in Nashville, and selling the image. And they've got big names talking at each of those. The last one, Lauren Zwanziger, is speaking. And she's the O'More student that has more Pinterest followers than Vogue magazine and all the big fashion magazines combined. I've heard a lot about this, yeah. Yeah, so I would like to go and learn how to do that myself. <laughs> um, and, yeah, Sally Lindley is going to be there, contributor to Vogue, Amanda Van Valentine, mm -hmm. um, a lot of big names. Cool. Thursday, some more runway shows. Uh, this will be at Nashville's historic Belmont Mansion. Um, and they're kind of doing more of a salon style thing. Uh, there's some collections from Modern Trousseau, Mamika by Gustavo Cadil, and afterwards will be a tea luncheon at the new Boulevard, Arnold Mint's new um, restaurant over on Belmont, and uh, used to be Cha Cha's. Ah, right? yeah, same spot, yeah. Yeah, and um, and all that day is Shop Nashville Day. There's over 40 boutiques. Um, it's going to be kind of a boutique crawl instead of an art crawl. Okay. And, uh, and that's sponsored by the Gulch. Will they have wine at that? I'm sure. Okay, good. Champagne in a boutique. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> and Friday, um, they're going to show off Leona, mm -hmm. the outfit I'm wearing. Um, works by Lauren Leonard and uh, the Danish fashion house of Sand. 
and they're going to be showing off designer Loggy Nadu of Chicago and Abi Ferrin, uh, Texas's next top designer for 2010. Uh, and then that's all going to happen at Grand Avenue's new space downtown. And there's going to be a pop-up dinner afterwards, um, hosted by Chef Rosario and Cody Bilou. Oh uh, yeah, Cody Bilou. Am I saying that right? I think it's Bilou. Bilou. Yes. You would know this is the Nashville-based soul singer um, that was a finalist on NBC's The Voice. Last season's Voice. Yep. So cool. Figured you would know how to pronounce I, it. I, yeah, I think <laughs> I got that. Um. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, closing party after the dinner at Anthem. And then Saturday is the grand finale, also at Anthem, and that will be the Emerging Designer Showcase. They just announced yesterday uh, the, mer the Emerging Designers. Uh, Philip Madison, Corello, Blooming, Leopold, Jennifer Nina Evans, Elizabeth Suzanne, Sarah Jane Estes, and Voyage Clothing. And, um, and Michael Knight will be there as a mentor all weekend. He's the runway all-star challenge designer. So, um, awesome. And that, that closes out the week, a very long yeah, week. Yeah, it is going to be intense. I'm going to everything. Everything? Yes. Wow. Uh, yeah. it, it, it seems like also a good chance to check out a lot of the, a lot of new spots in there. Like they seem yeah. to be using like Pub Five, which I've heard Pub about Five, and trying Anthem. to go to Anthem and uh, Arnold Anthony. Mintz new place. Yeah, Arnold Mintz. It's all brand new stuff. So, yeah. new new designs, uh, new fashion, new venues. Uh, it's going to be quite a spectacle. Very cool. So it already seems like a very busy week in, in Nashville and downtown. But on top of that, uh, you've also got uh, Tuesday through Saturday the annual Tin Pan South songwriters festival which will take over uh, 10 different venues in town most of them pretty well established as opposed to new stuff you've got the bluebird cafe douglas corner um listening room station Inn, etc uh the rutledge but there's there's a uh, i think well over 100 uh songwriters it's an all songwriter music festival and so that runs the gamut stylistically of course but we've got a number of um the biggest names are, are country stars you've got uh jake owen and charles kelly of uh lady antebellum uh, Ashley Monroe, member of Pistol Annie's. Um, and then you've also got lots of like uh, well known behind the scenes songwriter people. Like, um, actually, well, a pretty famous one is Cara DeGuardi, who was uh, formerly a judge on American Idol. Um, and then lots of other big, big name, uh, behind the scenes, big names songwriters in Nashville, like Gary Burr. Um, so it's a great uh, chance to see a lot of uh, songwriters and people you might not always see on a stage playing the songs that are famous and explaining. Um, how they wrote them and that sort of thing. They they have um, passes where you can uh, go to as many shows as you want. Those are unfortunately sold out, um, but every show has an individual uh, door admission, so you just go to tinpansouth.com and you can look up all the details on that. Uh, we'll also have a full story in, a, in my roundup of, of um, I guess, the can't miss shows. I hate to pick and choose. There's so much good stuff, but um, just the can't miss shows for every night of the week. Um, so you can look for that in tomorrow's ticket section. Um, as well as on Tennessean.com slash music. Um, well, that's all we got this week. Everyone uh, enjoy yourselves uh, out there doing Fashion Week in Tin Pan. should be a good time. Um, awesome. Well, yeah, thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next week.